It is time for another video. Very, very massive, massive trade-in. Full of amazing stuff. A lot of crazy stuff. Amazing Dreamcast PS1 stuff. We got the whole Tower of Games going. But before we get into this, be sure to come in every Wednesday, 6 p.m. to our Facebook page where we will do live claim sales. So let's just let's just get right into it here. I'm gonna tackle this uh, Jenga tower I've got going on here. Start off with these bad boys. We've got Street Fighter Third Strike for the Dreamcast. Awesome, awesome stuff. Very tough game to find. People say it's one of the best Street Fighter games ever. And this is the Dreamcast version of it. And we've got Street Fighter Alpha 3 for the Game Boy Advance. Awesome stuff. Another crazy one. This is complete in box. A lot of awesome stuff. I'll be stacking these up here. PlayStation. We've got Marvel vs. Capcom Clash of Superheroes. This is another uh, crazy fighting game here. This is the original Marvel vs. Capcom, which has been gaining a lot of popularity lately. Uh, I think people are starting to realize it was a pretty pretty darn good fighting game. Here's a, here's a hefty boy right here. JoJo's Bizarre Adventure for the Dreamcast. Amazing, amazing game. It's got the manual. It's in great condition. Very beautiful case. And just a legendary game based upon a legendary series. Uh, we bought out another collector who was very much into the fighting. Fighting video games. And... Well, you can tell here with all the crazy stuff you had. Here's Marvel vs. Capcom 2 for the Sega Dreamcast. Take you for a ride. All that jazz. Very broken fighting game, <laughs> if I recall. All sorts of characters. A lot of fun. And we've got Marvel Super Heroes vs. Street Fighter, which is apparently different from Marvel vs. Capcom, I guess. I don't know. I don't know which came first. Marvel versus Marvel Super Heroes versus Street Fighter. I think this is the first one. I think this came before Capcom. Yeah, because it was just Street Fighter. So we're gonna continue on with this. And believe me, guys, there's a whole lot more amazing Dreamcast PlayStation games. So we're just gonna fly right through them here. Here's Capcom versus SNK. Got our boy Terry Bogard on there. He's the man, rest assured. Cool game. And what is this one? We've got the King of Fighters Dream Match 1999. <laughs> it's still good, even though it came out in 1999. SNK enters the realm of dreams. <laughs> SNK enters the realms of the realm of dreams. Okay. We've got dream walkers here. <laughs> Shamanism. All that stuff. <laughs> Love it. Another Dreamcast game. King of Fighters Evolution. That's K right there. The new took over as the main character, sorta, of, for a little bit there, I believe. I'm not the I'm not the best with the King of Fighters lore, but I believe that is what happens. Here's Street Fighter Alpha 3 for the Dreamcast. Zangief. Going berserk as always. Just ripping over the cover there. These are beautiful condition games. Some of the best fighting games ever. Awesome Dreamcast stuff to get for sure. And here's one of my favorite games. Vigilante 8 Second Offensive. Now I play I never played Vigilante 8 too, but I played the first one. And it was it was a lot, a lot, a lot of fun. And Dreamcast version's got the four player multiplayer there. I mean 30 bucks, man. That's a that's a good time on the Dreamcast for only 30 bucks. Here we've got our types for the PlayStation. We can replace this case, don't worry. The CD cases you can replace, and we keep all the discs. Uh, we put all the discs away, but rest assured we actually have the discs. <laughs> a lot of uh, this is R Type 1 and 2, good stuff. Well, I'll mention get a new case for that one. All right, what about this one? Mega Man X4 for the PlayStation. Another awesome game. Cool stuff, but yeah, Collector came in and wanted to cash out his collection. And he had uh, quite the uh, PlayStation 1 Dreamcast uh, collection going on. And uh, I'll even see here, a lot of great games. A lot of fantastic games. 
And well, there's a there's a bunch of games to go through here still. We still got a tower of games. Here's Mega Man X6. I never played these Mega Man X games, so I couldn't really tell you what's what, but it's got zero. It's got the robot with hair. So it's gotta be gotta be at least pretty good. Twisted Metal 4. Uh, Twisted Metal series is pretty fun. I think 4 might be one people don't like, but you'd have to really screw up Twisted Metal to not like it here. Here's Mortal Kombat Trilogy. This is one of the few incomplete ones that doesn't have the uh, back cover. But it's still a good one to get. And here's Street Fighter Alpha 3 from PlayStation. PlayStation version of this game. God, these Capcom fighters, man. They are something else. A lot of fun. And they made a lot of them, apparently. I didn't even know a lot of these games existed. Like the Street Fighter collection here. I mean, what, what all even get in it? Greatest collection of fighters just entered the arena. <laughs> okay. That's that's pretty bold. Street Fighter 2, Alpha 2 Gold. Street Fighter 2 Turbo. I like it. I like to hear it. Here's Capcom versus SNK Pro for uh, the second one, or is this also on Dreamcast? I don't know, but it's cool stuff. Now here's an old, old PlayStation game. I remember having this one myself, Street Fighter Alpha 2. I think this is the one that introduced uh, Evil Ryu, <laughs> whatever his name is. We, no, who knows what he's called. But awesome stuff. And what else we got? Street Fighter Plus Alpha EX. Jesus. Capcom, what are you doing here? These titles. This is a, a 3D Street Fighter game. Looks pretty early. Kind of reminds me of uh, early Tekken games. Very, very blocky. Here's the sequel. Got Ken there. Yeah, these are uh, pretty legendary games. <laughs> M. Bison <laughs> looks... And Bison looks like those memes where you just take someone and make their eyes glow. <laughs> That's what it looks like to me. Crazy stuff. Your Street Fighter 2 collection. Which, uh, I guess there's just multiple collections. Street Fighter 2, Championship Edition, and Turbo. All for the PlayStation. Alright, that's PlayStation 1 and the Dreamcast. So, I guess we will tackle the, uh, let's do the Nintendo stuff. We'll do Nintendo. Start with the NES here. Get a good old paper boy from the NES. Fun stuff. Well, I'll just grab this whole stack of NES games. Here's RC Pro-Am. Another awesome uh, Nintendo game. And these are three of the same game. <laughs> They're all Mario Brothers and Duck Hunt. <laughs> Come on. Come on, guys. We got a couple Switch games here. Let's pull them off here. And what is it? Minecraft for the Switch. Oh, that's a cool one. And we've got Pokemon Sword for the Nintendo Switch. Even battle would be the best. That's that's encouraging. Let's do the GameCube and the Wii here. Obviously, we've got some heavy hitters here. Super Smash Brothers Melee and F-Zero GX. I had some pretty good GameCube stuff, too. Not a ton, but you yeah, had some of the great ones here. This is uh, Smash Brothers Melee. Classic game, and one of my favorite games, F-Zero GX. I love the F-Zero series. Ton of fun. GameCube games are great. The N64 game is great. Both very expensive, hard to get these days. Because uh, people realize how good they were. Here's Wii Sports Resort. And the original Super Mario Galaxy. And we got a couple more Wii Sports, just throw in there. And here's the rest of the GameCube games, which there's some cool stuff here. Nothing too crazy. Games I've never heard of. Here's Reckless, the Yakuza mission. <laughs> that looks like quite the Yakuza mission here, where you strap a missile onto the front of your car and just hit pedestrians and run them over. <laughs> I approve. I completely approve. More missions, more mayhem. Awesome stuff. What is this? We've got Universal Studios. <laughs> oh, God. It's a VIP ticket to theme park adventure. 
This looks awful. <laughs> or I don't know, it might be cool. Who knows? <laughs> Who knows? And we've got Capcom versus SNK2. EO, I guess. I don't know what the EO is. Looks pretty cool though. Uh, I mean, Capcom makes good fighters, guys. So you gotta check it out. Let's do the Xbox stuff. We got a whole Xbox One 360 tower here. Call of Duty Modern Warfare for the Xbox One. For Honor, this is a really fun multiplayer game. Pretty cool stuff. Atari Flashback Classics. Uh, that's the old price on it. We charge $14.99. Here is MX versus ATV Supercross Encore. I'm just going to grab a bunch of these. Dying Light. We got Jedi Fallen Order, which is like Dark Souls Star Wars, I believe. Monster Jam Crush It, which I believe was a Wii game, but come all the way here to the Xbox One. How popular it was. Wolfenstein The New Order. Crash Team Racing Nitro Fueled. Okay, that's pretty good. Just Dance 2018. <laughs> We're beating the price here. <laughs> and we've got NASCAR Heats. Oh, this is a sports game. <laughs> He's very, very excited to be winning. Refuse to lose. There you go. If you ain't first, you're last. And Baja, edge of, edge of something. Edge of control. <laughs> oh, Xbox One. How you humor us so. All right. What else we got? Call of Duty Black Ops. Call of Duty Infinite Warfare. Call of Duty Day Zero Edition. Sonic Forces, where you can make your own Sonic the Hedgehog character. And he takes part in the story. NBA 2K22. This is a sports game. <laughs> so we got to look at this guy. <laughs> oh... That face. <laughs> it looks like you just saw a UFO. <laughs> I love the, the sports games <laughs> covers. A timeless Battlefront. Here's Fallout 76. And, well, we got some more. So we're, we've hit the era where we have more Xbox One games than Xbox 360 games. That's scary. Dead or Alive 1 Ultimate. And this pretty cool uh, cover. I don't know what this is about. Maybe it was part of a two-pack or something. There's the second part. What is this? Tao Fang, Fist of the Lotus. Wow, that's a that's a creepy cover right there. What kind of game is this? It looks pretty cool. Kind of reminds me of Mortal Kombat. Here's the infamous Sega GT 2002 and Jet Set Radio feature. <laughs> Good collection of games. Terminator 3, Rise of the Machines. Perfect. I mean, probably pretty cool for the original Xbox. What is this? I don't even know. Co I'm not even gonna, I'm not even gonna try, guys. It's a fighting game. <laughs> Come and get it. <laughs> and the 360 games. I'm just gonna pull these on in here. Grand Theft Auto, San Andreas, Fable. Grand Theft Auto uh, episodes from Liberty City. Project Gotham Racing 3. Here's Super Straight Fighter 4 Arcade Edition. Marvel Ultimate Alliance. Hey, yeah, that's a great game right there. Minecraft for the Xbox 360. And Dead or Alive 5, which is another great fighting game. A lot of good fighting games here. Last but not least, PlayStation. And then we'll do some other stuff. PS3 games. Beyond. Ellen, Ellen Page and Willem Dafoe. William Defoe, my oh boy. Grand Theft Auto 5, PlayStation 3. And now we get a whole bunch of PlayStation 4 games. So what we get? We got Sonic, Team Sonic Racing. We got the Dwarves. <laughs> what is this? The Dwarves? <laughs> I don't know. But he plays a dwarf. Fallout 4, that's a classic game. Doom Eternal, another great game. And Resident Evil 4 from PlayStation 4. All great games. The PS4 might actually have some good games, guys. I'm just messing with you. All right, I'm just messing with you guys. Here's Watch Dogs Legion. Here's Little Big Planet 3. Oh, that's pretty ad adorable little yarn figures. Another Grand Theft Auto 5. 
the sign for PlayStation 4. Street Fighter 5 Arcade Edition. And NBA, okay. NBA TK 15. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not sure what to say about this one, guys. I really don't know what to say <laughs> about that. About that face. But it's legendary. No, I, I love it. I love it. All right. Assassin's Creed Valhalla. And Far Cry 6. And we got some PS2 stuff here. Dragon Quest 8. Look at that. Box is pretty messed up, but the case is great and the case has the manual, so that's good. And we've got ATV Off Road Fury 2. Let's grab a stack here. SSX 3, Tech and Tag Tournament. Guilty Gear X. That's a good one. Pretty awesome stuff. What is this? Airblade, Fanta Vision, and Grand Theft Auto Vice City. We're just gonna. That's that's everything. We'll take care of it later. Kind of push everything towards our logo and hope no one notices. We got an N64 in. We sell these old consoles, guys, so come get them. We got a GameCube controller. We got a whole bunch of GameCube controllers, actually. We got Super Nintendo came in. This hair dryer isn't part of the trade-in. <laughs> that is personal. Personally, these hair dryer. We got the Wii. We got a GameCube player back there. A lot of cool stuff came in. And look at this. We got a Vita. Cool stuff. Lots and lots and lots and lots of stuff. My favorite part, a whole case of loose 3DS, DS, 3DS games. That's a, that's a Vita memory card. That doesn't count. So let's just pull them out. Let's see what we got here. Professor Layton, The Curious Village. Okay, that's a good one. We're off to a great start. There's Pokemon Sun. Another great one. What is... What else is in here? Come on. What are you? Oh, come on. Focus. Little League World Series Baseball. Ugh. <laughs> Not good. Not good. Super Scribble Knots. I gotta hold it up to the light here. Cars Master National. <laughs> This is rapidly getting worse and worse. MLB Power Pros 2008. <laughs> Avatar Lost Airbender, The Burning Earth. Okay. I accept. All right, two more. Last two. Please be a home run. Four. Okay, I don't know what that is. <laughs> that doesn't count. And it's Gribble Knots. Okay, that's good. Nothing else in there. All right, that is, that's everything, guys. Come into the store, check out the claim sales every Wednesday. We got to get all this stuff put away, but I'll see you guys next time. Go games. Maritime, Florida, Merritt Square Mall. Till next time.